Welcome back to Fanboy Media. In this episode, I'm going to show a number of books that I pulled out probably a year and a half, two years ago, to make a contest video. And to be honest, I can't even remember whose contest it was, but I never got around to filming it. Uh, it was something like your top 10 comics or something along that line. So before I actually put these away, I just thought I would go ahead and show them since I have them pulled out. This is my second copy of Amazing Spider-Man 129. Uh, I just showed my uh, one that I CGC'd. Um, this one does have one or two tiny ticks, but otherwise it's a very nice copy. Uh, I pulled out Spectacular Spider-Man number one. A uh, really sharp copy would probably grade quite high. Uh, first Tarantula, if I'm not mistaken. Tales of Suspense, number 52. First appearance of Black Widow. Uh, this one, yeah, a bit rough. Uh, Batman, number 181. First appearance of Poison Ivy. Um, it's a low-grade copy, and I will look to eventually upgrade, but I do have it. Uh, Batman Adventures number 12, first appearance of Harley Quinn. Um, not the highest grading copy, and when I bought it, I just wanted a copy. I wasn't so much collecting at the time, as I just wanted to read the story. Um, now and then I started collecting again so now I kind of regret I didn't get a better or higher grade copy uh, when I had the opportunity uh, Amazing Spider-Man 41 first appearance of the Rhino uh, very nice copy of Spider-Man number 50 first appearance of the Kingpin uh, just a tiny tick there and I think a little knock or mark, color breaking mark on the bottom corner, but otherwise sharp corners, beautiful appearance. Uh, Fantastic Four, number five, first appearance of Doctor Doom. Definitely a low grade copy, but I do have a complete run of Fantastic Four, which, you know, may, probably someday I'll upgrade. And finally, Fantastic Four, number 48. First appearance of Silver Surfer, um, the first Fantastic Four key that I ever got. I was actually, oh, probably 14, 15 years old when I got it, found it at the flea market. So I have, like I said, a complete run of Fantastic Four, uh, but I chose these books to be sort of slightly diverse. Two Fantastic Four, because it's my main title. Uh, three Spider-Mans, because it's my next major title, and then a handful of others. Um, like I could have pulled out Fantastic Four, one, two, three, four, six, seven, blah, blah, blah. Um, but uh, I just thought this was a fun mix to pull out. I uh, hope you enjoyed seeing it. Thank you for watching. Have a good day.